going down this creepy hall now. There's a wheelchair in the middle. And if you listen quietly, I'll stop talking. You can hear it. I did not know that there was a church in here. Oh my God, look at that stained glass. I love churches like this. I gotta get the whole crew up here. Look at the, look at the carvings. Whoa. This place is completely untouched. Let's go find out what that beeping is. It's an alarm system. It must have been going off forever. The thing is, we have permission to be in here, which is cool. So, I don't know what's up. This is the prep area. Prep everything for church back here. Got a little kitchen. Oh, and this comes right back out to where we started. How do we get up to the balcony? So we had to figure out how to get up here. Turns out it's the stairs to the third floor. That's how you get up here. Look at that window. Look at that. Oh my God. Look at that window right there. Gotta get a close up of that. So we just met up with John. Uh, I didn't know where he was, so I was like super scared when I heard this like deep voice talking. But uh, he just said up top here, there's like a weird interference with his mic, and it's like a loud like screeching noise. I'm gonna see if we can replicate it on this mic as well. Might be. Yeah, let's see. Whatever this is right here. Yeah. Let's see if there's a loud screeching noise coming from it. This is where you did it. You tested it. This is exactly where I did it. Yo, why does the thing keep shutting off? So you could hear it briefly. You could hear that sound. Let's raise this up. We're gonna go up to the top, see what we can find. See if we can get a better vantage point. Oh man. This is like a industrial room. We got the generators going up here. And the power's still on, so they're fully running. Oh, John, this is what you're experiencing. What? Radio frequency energy may exceed exposure limits. There's a radio frequency outside, that's why. Warning, beyond this point, frequency fields at the site may exceed FCC rules for human exposure. Like we're not supposed to be up there because we could die. So if someone passes out, like we could probably hear this right now. Or it's like affecting us right now maybe. And we can't even hear it because it's like, it's like supersonic. Yo, this is how you get up there. That's the top top. All right, everyone's up here. We just climbed this very tall tower, or ladder, to get into this, the tower, the very top of this, this uh, building. 
got a bunch of ladders and stuff. And it's like, this is what, um, if you ever played the game Thief, I'm pretty sure he lived in a tower, a clock tower, and it looked pretty similar to this. That's what I'm picturing. I didn't know what to expect when we got to the top, but it's a big open dome, and there's like a huge tank here. I'm wondering if there's anything inside of it. So I'm currently on this ladder. It's shaking like no one's business. Uh, John said there's nothing in it, so I'm gonna believe him. Oh my god. This thing is about to break any second. John's gonna take it, because he's light. He's like a little, uh... I'm like a little fat there. <laughs> so, Cody's camera, I'm just showing you guys that. There's nothing here, but it's really cool. I mean, just a big dome that sits in the middle. Very curious to know what's inside it, but unfortunately, my little weak hands can't actually lift it. You're like a little, little, a little small guy right there. <laughs> uh, this is really cool, though. I can actually see it. Ah, oh, it's amazing. Here. This is this is the lab. Yeah. This is the lab where they would, uh, you know, work on treatments and stuff. Maybe mix some stuff. I don't know exactly what doctors do. <laughs> I just know they have lots of beakers and this is the main laboratory. Nice hand wash station. Oh, look at this. Abs ethanol. Absinthe, maybe? Abs, abs ethanol. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it's a lot of ethanol. <laughs> Is it <laughs> the pad? Oh god! Oh shit! It's warm in here too. All right. So it looks like someone might have been living here. Mm-hmm. It's a jacket, and I mean, if this is the pad, oh, alcohol, of course. They did. Oh, he did say that they had problems with homeless people breaking in here. Wow. Look at that blood. So, if they were shooting up and then they just took their blood and splattered it all over the walls. That's what I'm guessing. It looks like someone just like flicked a bunch of blood on the wall with like a paintbrush. Maybe they're an artist. Might have been Van Gogh. He found the psychiatric ward. Secure oh. area authorized personnel only. Let's go see what's inside. Hey guys. Holy. <laughs> Alright, let's no, go in. I knew it was a psychiatric. <laughs> Steve's here. Steve's here. The crazy one. So this this hospital had a church, had normal patient rooms, but it also had a psychiatric ward as well. Straps for your uh, body? Legs. Yeah. Legs. Yeah. Those board. straps hold you down. Dude, yeah, these are straps that hold you down and stuff. That's awesome. This is meant for the psychiatric ward. Is this meant for the psych ward? Look, is that like a, is that like one of those street jackets? Let's pull it out. Let's see what it looks like. Just the cloth. I don't know. It's so long. I don't know. <laughs> this is crazy. It's like a horror movie working for this. Getting ready for the good stuff. Alright, Steve, no funny business. Yeah, Steve. We're oh! That is a morgue. Oh! Dang. Okay, okay. Oh, look at this! You're right here on the morgue. Cremator, right here. That is so no, 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 cool. No, 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 that's not the this is where the bodies go. This is where they get frozen. Oh! <laughs> that is so cool. That's so crazy. I'm with you. And this is where this is where they take them apart, right? Uh, yeah, this is the whole thing. Where they this is where they cut them all up and everything. Yeah. So guys, right now, this is the morgue. This is where the bodies would lay on here. There's a grate so that the blood can flow down into the sink. There's like sponges and cleaning tools here. I never think, I would never have thought I would find this in here. This is ridiculous. But, I mean, amazing at the same time, yet creepy. Peek into this bucket and see. Supposedly, this is where they put all the extra parts, and uh, 
you know, if they didn't want the parts, parts to get in the way, they are just throw in this little bucket. Let's see if there's actually anything. Looks clean to me right now. But yeah, that's the, that's the extra body part bucket right there. If you look in here, you can actually see blood. There's blood all stained in this morgue. Or in the slot that the body would be in. It's like a creepy hallway. Supposedly there's another floor that goes down even farther. Let's go. Not a subject to the real basement of things. Oh, this looks creepy. Staircase access B. Oh my god. Look at this, dude. Okay, so I don't know if Josh is screwing with us. Oh, caution asbestos. Yo, where did that monkey at? Yeah, Josh, where's that monkey? All right, the monkey's here, all right, it's in the tunnel. Let's go see it, we walked all the tunnels. Yeah, we should right oh, yeah. 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 Show the monkey here. Oh, where's the monkey? Exactly, so now I'm gonna show them where the monkey is. <laughs> show we, gotta, we gotta go down in the basement over show here. Show me this monkey, man. Yeah. Yeah. Josh said he found a monkey, like a dead monkey skeleton down there. Yes, I did. He's gonna take us there, because we tried finding it, but we couldn't find it. Let's go see what you got. Let's, oh, let's see the freaking monkey. <laughs> I, I don't even believe you. How about, how about, um, you, you wanna leave to where the monkey is? I don't even believe it. Right. Oh. It's probably a stuffed animal. I'm ready for this dead monkey. Hey guys, you ready? Yeah. I lied. There's no, there's no monkey. <laughs> I knew so it. We all just kind of just went, okay, we're gonna do it. <laughs> so, we, so we just walked through asbestos for freaking no monkey. monkey. All right, guys. Josh just completely wasted our time. We were trying to find a monkey this whole time. He's like, yeah, there's a monkey everywhere. There was no monkey at all. I'm just as upset as you are. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna get out of here. We're tired of this place. It's been amazing, but we are just so tired and drained. We've been here for a, such a long time, so many hours. Uh, we're gonna get out of here, follow the whole crew. You know what to do. I'll see you guys later. This is creepy, man. No monkey yet. <laughs> 